Hi. <laughs> hey, what's up? I'm Olga, and this is Artem, and we've been going to HFCN for me nine years and... 13 years? 15 years. Together as a family, nine. Yes. <laughs> With our children, collectively. These last uh, couple of weeks or so, Adrian's been talking about uh, how God is enough in our lives, and we just have a couple of stories to share of how true that was for us and our family. So early on in our marriage, uh, we I didn't really have a job. I just graduated from nursing school, and we were just kind of figuring out our lives. And um, at one point, our bank account was not healthy looking. <laughs> and um, I don't really know if we shared it with anybody, um, like our financial issues or struggles or whatever. But um, one day we came home to our apartment and we walked through the front and then walked through the house to the back or home to the, to the townhouse and there was like an envelope kind of wedged in the back door and we opened it up and it's like a blank card with like a few hundred dollars in there and it just completely amazed us and it's like God provided for us in a time where we didn't really I don't remember sharing with anybody like our financial issues but God knew what we needed and obviously he put us on somebody's heart to provide for us in that moment um, in our lives and I just think that it's a really amazing thing. Uh, another story that comes to mind is when Thomas was born um, he had a few not super serious medical things that we just needed to monitor. And so as time went on, uh, those issues didn't correct themselves. And so we had to have sur- he had to have surgery. I guess he was about a year and a half at that point. And so we had to take him to UVA and he had a surgery. And at that point we had health insurance, but it was health insurance with a really super high deductible. And so we didn't know how we were gonna pay it. But uh, the way that things worked out, that God orges- orchestrated is that my day job wouldn't cover it, but I did side jobs. And so my side job, I ended up landing a pretty decent side job. And so that ended up paying for the deductible right as we needed, needed it. And um, but then the crazy part is we paid it, no sweat. And then a few months later, we get a letter saying, hey, you guys didn't actually have to pay it. And so we're gonna give you your money back. And so that was just such a cool moment for us. Um, because like Olga mentioned before, like we weren't, we didn't have crazy good jobs or anything like that. We we're just newly wed couples. I mean, that was almost two years at that point, but I mean, we just, we we're still trying to figure out life and what we wanted to do and, and whatnot. And so our financial status was always pretty tight. And so God really um, kind of blessed us and provided for us in that moment. And, and, and really, as our family grew, God always provided. Um, that was something that we never, had to worry seriously. Now my anxiety sometimes kicks in thinking about that kind of stuff, but I always know that God has always come through and he's never let our family starve. And so with every every child that we had, God improved our financial situation to either a raise or a better job. Um, and now I'm not advocating for more kids, but <laughs> if you want to test those waters, have that. that's, that's just our story. And that's how God provided for us, and um, all glory goes to Him. You know, even the health and the wisdom that He's given me is all Him, um, and the abilities or skill or whatever you want to call it, it's all because of Him. The last story that I want to share is a moment uh, years ago when I had just gotten pregnant with Thomas. Um, again, we were in that season of life, and we had needed some financial assistance, so I ended up going to um, Hope Distributed. And so I kind of like sat at the back, I was like really nervous, I was like, I don't want to be here kind of thing. And Pastor Margaret came up to me and she just started chatting and I just started crying and I'm like, I'm pregnant! And like, it was just such a like, uh, like heavy time in our lives, like we were not prepared or anything like that financially and then we got pregnant and it's just like a lot. I think it was just last year she came up to me. Um, she's like, remember that time, like where we were years ago? And um, so she remembered that moment. I can definitely say, like, a full heart.
heart how grateful I am for those moments because that's when um, we rely more on God. I feel like when um, we live in abundance, it can be really easy to kind of be like, I'm good on my own. So um, in those moments, we truly learned um, just how much God provided for us in every moment. And I'm not saying that as like a cliche thing, like we live through it and that is like our truth and who he is, you know. And I think that also helped us grow as a family to go through that journey, uh, to go through those struggles, um, you know, not just financially, but also getting pregnant early and growing our family at such a young age. And not that we're old, but we started our family super young, a lot younger than we wanted to. God took us through that and I think we've come out stronger as a family and life is good. God is good. Amen. <laughs>